Hello music lovers, my name is Sharon and welcome to Yuka Sean. Um, today I'll be doing a tutorial for Hey There Delilah by Twi the Plain White Tees, sorry. Um, if you want to see the cover, click right there, but other than that, I hope you enjoy. Uh, these are the chords I'll be needing for the song. If you know these chords, skip ahead. If not, here we go. A. B minor 7. D. G flat minor. Personally, I think could be minor 7 sounds better, but there are some tabs online where it's B minor. The structure of this song is an intro, verse 1, verse 2, chorus, verse 3, verse 4, repeat the chorus, bridge, verse 5, and an ending. The strum pattern for this song is down, down, up, up, down. You mostly do it twice on each chord, chords where you only do it once. The only uh, kind of different thing is the introduction. There's a way you could play it where you pick it, but the introduction, what you do, you hold down a D chord, but you only pluck the bottom three strings. Uh, so it's like this. You pluck the bottom three strings four times. And then you change to a G flat minor, and then you pluck the bottom sh three strings four times again. And then you repeat that. Chord progression for the verses are D, G flat minor, D, G flat minor, B minor 7, G, A, B minor 7, if I play verse 1, it would sound like this. Hey there, Delilah, what's it like in New York City? I'm a thousand miles away, but girl, tonight you look so pretty. Yes, you do. Times Square can't shine as bright as you. I swear it's true. The chorus, the chord progression is... D, B minor 7, and then you repeat it four times. The chorus sounds like this. Oh, it's what you do to me. And then you repeat that four times, and that's the chorus. The chord progression for the bridge is G, A, D, B minor 7, G, a, D, B minor 7, G, A, B minor 7, A. So the bridge sounds like this. A thousand miles seems pretty far. They've got planes and trains and cars. I'd walk to you if I had no other way. Our friends would all make fun of us, and we'll just laugh along because we know none of them. is a bit different from all the other verses. The chord progression for verse 5 is D, G flat minor, D, G flat minor, B minor 7, G, A, B minor 7, G, A, B minor 7, G, A, B minor 7, A. So the beginning part's the same, but there's a bit of an addition at the end. And then the ending, it's essentially B minor, D, and then you repeat that four times, and then you end on a, another D. So the ending sounds like this. Whoa. songs on a downstroke. Um, 
yeah for verse 5 you can probably figure out where everything goes because the song has a pretty good um rhythm and such so you can figure that out but um yeah that Hey everyone, thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you didn't notice, I had to write down some of it. I've had a pretty busy week, so um, yeah, sorry about that. Um, most most of the time I have time to memorize a song to teach you guys, but yeah. Um, but I'm, I think it's pretty alright. Same thing, you guys got all the information. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. Comment video ideas you have below, subscribe if you want to see more. Um, have a great day and keep sharing music everyone.